Hello and welcome to another episode of GNG News. So today we have the Shining Legends pin collection, but to make a change since we've done, I think, seven Mewtwo Shining Legend pin collection boxes, we've got Pikachu one. This is the second Pikachu box that I've done. Um, we have three booster packs, Shining Legends, which are Gen Set, Mega Rayquaza, and I think that's the normal Mewtwo, not the fighting type. Obviously, it comes with that awesome um, Pikachu pin, which I'm giving to my friend who has let me unbox this box. Um, and it comes with that really cool Pikachu promo. So I'm just going to very quickly unbox this and see what we get. Hopefully, because it's not a Mewtwo box, we get... Uh, I want Shining Ho-Ho from this box because combined, my friend has the Shining Mew. I have a Shining Mew and... Uh, what was the other one that I had? Shining Arceus... Um, Legendary Hooper, Latios, so we had quite a few good cards. I can't really pull anything apart today because, well, I'm a bit bit stupid today. Um, but anyways, let's just get this one open as quickly as we can. I'm just destroying this box. I'm really sorry to the people who make these. I've just destroyed your hard work. Oh, well. Anyways. Right. So once we take this out, as you can see, 70 health points, um, basic form, Pikachu, electric type. It is a reverse holo. Um, nice effect to it. Looks like it's leaping out of the card. And I'll just read the little bit of information on the bottom. A plan was recently announced to gather many Pikachu and make a electric power plant. That would actually make a lot of money. Anyways. So when you take it out, you don't get three code cards, you get four. So that's the first code card. So you need to go to pokemon.com forward slash TCGO, put in that code, which is 60W. Uh, TZXD9H9GNK. I'll leave that in the background just in case anyone who hasn't claimed it can claim it. So these are three packs, as I said. So from left to right, we have Mewtwo, Mega Marie Kaza, and the Gen Set Pokemon. I don't like that Pokemon. Um, I don't know why. I just think that it's not a very good design for a Pokemon. Now, if you look at that, that is so cool. Um, just like Pokemon, and it's like playful little. Pose on the back of it. I uh, don't know if you're going to be able to read that, or the light will even pick it up. I'll see if I can maybe. So yeah, it just says Pokemon official pin. It's got loads of Pokeballs on the back of it, and obviously, you take this off to attach the pin on. I'm not going to do it because well, there'd be no point. But like I said, that is going straight to my friend because he's the one who's let me unbox this box. So big shout out to Liam for that. Um, there's going to end up being a graveyard of like packaging in my living room soon, but. Uh, you will see in the coming videos because I haven't. I, I think we uploaded three Pokemon videos yesterday. I did two already today, um, and I've probably got about nine, maybe ten more to do. Um, right, I'll start with Mewtwo because I'm sorry, but I'm really biased to Gen One because Gen One was like around the time. Well, that's when I started watching Pokemon. So, Golet, Croconaw, Litten, which is the Firestarter, La Vista, Breloom, uh, we got a Voltorb, which is a Gen 1 Shiny, so that's always cool. Manaphy, which is uh, a Legendary, so I guess that's pretty cool, but I've got several of these. Um, an Electric Energy, a Trainer Lily, can never pronounce his name, and a Carvine, which has 100 health points. And last but not least, that all important code card. So we didn't get any GXs or EXs in that pack, but it was pretty decent. So you need to put in this code, which is WWDLZ2RCM2WGH. I'll leave, I'll try and make enough of room so it can all be seen. That in the background, uh, change it up and I'll go for the Gen Set pack this time. If you like Pokemon, go to www.pokemon.com. I've got a good feeling about this pack already. So we got, I can't, I never pronounce this, uh, I think it's called a pulse, but um, it's a cheering Pokemon. It's pretty cool. Stungfish, Minum, which is, oh, here we are. So we've got both of them now. Oh, that's pretty cool. I'm going to put them in the background and make a little Pokemon, well, a little Pikachu display. There we are. So, Buzzle, Scraggy. Oh, we then got the same card as a shi <gasps> shiny Raikou. Oh, that's so cool. So we've got a legendary, well, one of the one of the original legendary dogs. If you know all the names of the original legendary dogs, let me know in the comment section down below. I know, I just want to know if you know. So already we have a really nice electric display in the background. An energy card, an Electroid Gen 1, a Floatzel, 
and an Arbok. I always just like Arbok. Um, cool thing about Arbok and Ekans, if you look at Ekans backwards, it says Snake, and if you look at Arbok backwards, it says Cobra, because they're the animals that they are based off. And to prove that, if you look at what type it is, what does that say? It's a Cobra Pokemon. Anyways, here's that code card, which is J4VNXN9CPV7XG. Um, I'll run through all the code cards in the end of the video. And this is the last pack that we've got, which is a Mega Rayquaza. So hopefully we get a GX or EX in this pack. So once again, Bunzel, Pikachu, Gen 1, that's pretty cool. Bulbasaur, Gen 1, that's pretty cool. Torquoil, Venusaur. Oh, <laughs> this is the fourth time I've got this card, and every single time it feels so good. <laughs> okay, so I don't care about that. <laughs> what Mewtwo GX in its like original fighting pose? Oh my god! It's Psy Strike GX, two hundred health points attack, super ob absorption, sixty health point attack, full burst, thirty plus attack, one hundred and ninety health points. I'm sorry, but you are not going to be able to copy that card. If you look how detailed them little lines are on this, that's what. Do you know what? This is a perfect time for me to show you that Taurus GX. Hold on. So I think I threw the Taurus GX in the bin. But these are some fake Pokemon cards that um, someone tried to show me. Just look how disgusting these look. We don't want them. You want that. That is absolutely awesome. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy with that. So that's made that whole pack opening worth it. We don't have a Rock-type energy. We don't have a Super Scooper. We don't have a Fergalic. So, oh, I can't even pronounce his name. And then we've got an Incineroar. Oh, I can show you the difference between a real and a fake. Look, this is a fake Incineroar on the left. And this is a real Incineroar on the right. You see how big the border difference is? See how the health points are not the same? The text isn't the same. The text box isn't the same. They don't even match. So, yeah, don't, don't buy fake cards. <laughs> and, of course, we have that all-important code card. So, we're just going to run through these very quickly. I'm really happy with that box, actually. Um... So, there's three code cards. I'm going to run through some of the cards at the end as well. There's that final code card. There's that really cool Pikachu pin. We ended up with... So, obviously, the best card that we pulled was the um, Mewtwo GX Psychic Pokemon 190 health points. Really happy about that. We then, I can't even pronounce his name, a Pulse, uh, Normal, and Hollow, a Minim, a Raikou, Shiny, and obviously the Pikachu promo card. Not forgetting, obviously, the other two Shinies that we got, which was a Voltorb Gen 1 and Manaphy, which I have been informed is a Legendary. So, thanks for watching that episode of GNG News. Big shout out for Liam for the Pokemon box, and you've got to catch them all.